Hey guys, here's a quick tutorial on how to share in our group. So the first thing that you might want to do, and this is totally not necessary, but you could, let's say I just wanted to share this whole presentation with these different options that I've made for my Google Form quizzes. So you could make a copy of the entire presentation first, and then maybe just put the word share at the beginning, um, or however you want to do it. And then maybe have a specific folder that you want to put everything in um, that you are sharing. So you could do that first. And then you'll be sharing this copy just in case um, you either mess up the share link or grant someone editing access from an email request or something. So. It's always just good to make a copy of it first. And then you don't have to worry about people messing this up or getting access to it. All right, so then you're going to click on Get Shareable Link. And it's going to say anyone at, so mine pops up automatically in my district, which is not going to work for pretty much everyone in our group. So I want to click on um, Change it to Anyone with the Link Can View. So I don't want them to be able to edit because then you'll have multiple people in your slides changing things around. So you want it to be on can view. And then another thing that you might want to check, check is go to advanced and make sure that you don't have these checked. Um, because if you have this bottom one checked here, then they will not be able to make a copy. Okay. All right, so once you have that, so it automatically copies this. Um, when you click Get Shareable Link, it copies it to your clipboard, and then you can paste it. So let's say you're making a Facebook post in our group. You can paste that link to share with everyone. And then if you want to, instead, I like for them to be able to view it before they make a copy. Um, but instead, if you wanted to force them to make a copy, you can change all of that to just copy. Let me do that one more time. So everything after the slash, you can change to copy. And that will force them to make a copy. So when they go to that link, it'll say, would you like to make a copy? And it'll automatically make a copy for them. Um, the other link, this link, is going to just give them view access. So they're going to be able to open it up and view it. Let me switch so it's not, it's just, it always switches to my, because I own it, it switches to me. This is what it would look like. If you clicked on a view only link, it says view only. And then you can go to file make a copy and you can make a copy of a single slide if you don't want the whole thing or you can make a copy of the entire presentation. So that's it. I hope that this helps the group members that are wanting to share their work. Thank you for sharing your work. Thank you to everyone who has shared. Um, the creativity in this group is astounding. Um, and don't forget to tag your posts. Also, we have all those awesome topic tags to keep all of this amazing work organized. So don't forget to do that as well. Thanks guys.